Whoa. <laughs> Heavy Betty, big bone. This could be a sockeye. Wow. PB for sure. Well, gang. I'm back here at my favorite Coconut Elite. It's been kind of a rough season. The most I've caught this year is eight, which is pretty decent. But I um, oh, I've lost a couple. Lost, lost three Dodgers. Got a double hookup on the bottom once, and then I accidentally dropped one. My favorite Dick Knight clown pattern. Had a few lures drop down through my scupper holes because I can't find my scupper plugs. Uh, oh yeah, I deleted my hard drive with the last two years of memories and great footage. So I did that. I deleted all the stuff on accident. So it's been a great year. I come out here this morning and it's like drizzling. You know, kind of rainy, whatever. To be expected. So hopeful the rain will hold off. Maybe I can catch a little bit of kokanee. It's the Friday before Memorial Day weekend, 2024. Anyways, late season, late spring kokanee. Late spring kokanee. Stick around. It's a drizzling. We got some tuna sardine with the Taylor fly. It's a pink and chartreuse pattern. We got some magenta, red, pink corn. This sardine. Bloody tuna mix. Oh, we'll go up 50 feet. 50 feet and we'll clip on and out. We'll drop it back 15 feet. Okay, we're fishing. Fly, spinning glow. What's gonna hit first? I'm gonna say the spinning glow. I am marking fish at 20 to 25 feet here, so I might be, we might be going deep already. Oh, got a hit on the fly. That was a good hit, too. Oh, he's on. Holy smokes. They are thrashing. You guys see that? Gonna go right through that area. Wow. Oh, wow. Big fish at 20 feet. Nice mark. Yeah, we're marking them deep, bud. We're marking them deep. Fish. We got a fish. fish 50 feet back little guy wow it's a nice fish actually on the fly. Okay, cooking number one. So that was on the surface. Orange corn. Brad's extreme kokanee dodger. I 
in my fly. A little spinner there. Ooh, well, one fish. That was cool. Kind of unexpected. That shows you you should always be expecting a fish. Got a fish. Ah, he's off. Fish. Fish number two. So, catching right at 50 feet back with a couple split shot above the uh, Dodger. I'll show you guys. Oh, it's a cutthroat. Yeah, it looked totally like a kokanee. Cutthroat, see? Nah, they're cool fish. They're just very small here. I want a big fish. Fish. Another little cutthroat. Tiny. Two micro cutthroat and a kokanee on the fly. A bunch of fish through here. Marking a bunch of fish. About 25, 30 feet down. <laughs> Heavy Betty, big bone. Wow. Oh, am I on a double? I'm on a double. feet I'm just getting back what I lost wow this could be a sockeye <laughs> man that thing hit like a freight train didn't it wow 20 feet Holy shit. You guys, this thing is killing me right now. Wow. PB for sure. PB for sure. Oh my gosh. Oh my freaking god, you guys. And I got a double.
probably just hitting the bottom. No, I do. A nice cutthroat that I'm going to take. <laughs> now that is a fat kokanee. Really a pretty nice cutthroat too. These fish are jumping like crazy guys. Come on. Whoa. Whoa. Nice fish again. Very nice fish. Very nice kokanee again. Wow. A very nice kokanee. Holy smokes. This is as good as they get, as far as I'm concerned. Huh? Pretty nice. Sit about it. Yeah, about 14. Wow. What a what a great morning. Absolutely beautiful morning. I took the day off from work <laughs> to come out here and then I got out here and it was like raining and still has a little drizzle right now. Getting a little breezy. But uh I just got two absolutely stud kokanee. I'm pretty happy right now. All right, fish. It's going pretty fast too. Like 1.6, 1.7. Stay down. Stay down. Oh shit. Five feet, man. This on the spinning glow. I went back 50 feet and then clipped on an ounce. Whew. 
number four. And that's another nice, nice kokanee. Gotta say, I want to spin and glow. Said I was doing like 1.7 there, man. Damn, a lot of blood in them. It's good though, you gotta bleed your fish. Got to bleed your fish. Kokanee number four. Nice one. Nice fish. A lot of action this morning, guys. Okay, let's uh, let's get our camera set up here. So far, we got four kokanee on ice in a nice cutthroat. I'm catching them on my homemade tube fly I made this year. It's a new combo, pink and chartreuse. Pretty nice. So, going 50 foot setback, a couple split shot above the uh, Brad's extreme kokanee dodger. Seems to be working. And my speed's been varying between like 1.3 to 1.3 to 1.7 on this last kokanee. Here's the Dodger I'm using. And then this is the other lure I'm using, Spin Glow. I've been using my orange fire corn with sardines. You see that? Mashed up for some extra stink. Anise. Let's see if we can catch a fish while I'm at I'm like live recording here too. That'd be pretty cool. I haven't got one like that yet. And actually I'm gonna let this one out 50. And then do clip on. One ounce ball. Get clip. Put it in there. centered just back 10 feet. We got a fish. We got a fish here. For sure. So, today is a good day. That's on my fly. Not bad. Nice fish, huh? Fish. Nice fish. Keep them pinned, buddy. Keep them pinned. Wow. What a take. Very nice fighting kokanee. This is definitely a heavy Betty Big Bone. Come on now, 20 feet. Oh yeah, 
beauty. Oh my God. Wow. These are just, a, these are the most beautiful fish I've ever. <laughs> what a beautiful thing. Huh? It's the tailor fly. Well, update time, guys. Starting to rain a little bit more than I'd like. Get close to 10 a.m. I'm going to give it one more hour. I got six on. So this would be a hell of a fourth quarter. You got a fish. We got a nice fish. We got a nice fish. Could be a kokanee. I think he's off. Off. Fish. I got a fish. I got a fish. Had a fish. fish. Come on, baby. Good fight. 25 feet back. Yeah, he's fighting me pretty good. Or she. I've just been hitting the same area, guys. Just kind of doing figure eight circles. Very chrome. It's just a regular kokanee. Number seven. Fish. Nice fish too. Whoa.
Another nice one. That'll do it for me, guys. Eight. That's been my number this year is eight. Why does that thing keep falling down like that? Anyways, just wrapped her up there. I don't know if you guys caught it because the camera went down, but it's 11 a.m. now. I got to get going. I'm, I'm tired. I'm ready for some food. I didn't bring any snacks today. I'm trying to watch my figure, you know. Anyways, my uh, tube fly killed it. Uh, when I get home, I'll show you guys the whole setup. But I kind of got footage already, so stick around. We're going to take these beautiful coconut, take them home, clean them up. Put them in my brine and we're gonna smoke them. <laughs> 